Chuck Lee says, Hi Robbie, this weekend I tried to dual boot Windows XP Service Pack 3 with Ubuntu 9.10. All seemed to go well once I went to reboot. It says, Grub loading error, no such disk. Any suggestion? And if I need to wipe everything and start over, I will just look for some direction. Okay. So you've you had Windows <coughs> installed, Windows XP, and you've now gone to dual boot with Ubuntu 9.10. So... Grub says error, no such disk, when you're trying to boot either operating system or just it never gets to the Grub menu. I'd love to know if it gets to the Grub menu. Hmm. And I, unfortunately, I, I yeah, you, uh, Underdog is saying uh, to just reinstall Grub from the live, live disk. Because you've got to understand, like, your, your operating systems are there on the drive. What Grub does is it's the, your bootloader, so it tells your system where to load the operating system from, essentially. Um, so by reinstalling Grub from the from the live disk, uh, and we'll see if we can find maybe a tutorial or something for you, that will repair that for you. Your your operating system you shouldn't have to reinstall, not at all. Just need to reinstall Grub, but the operating systems themselves shouldn't be necessary. But uh, you know it, it really depends on how much you want to play with it too. But insta- reinstalling Grub shouldn't be too difficult. There's a there's a, a disk that's available. Super Grub disk. I should mention, Sammy says, I can get to Grub menu, then get error 22. Jaunty died, and I can't recover it using encrypted LVM from alternate CD. Oh, that's a horse of a different color. You've got an encrypted drive, and you're using... So you might, you might just be using one of the older versions of Grub 2. So you'd want to make sure, but uh, yeah, super grub. Just for the, just because I was on that track, super grub disk is a great way to recover your grub bootloader. This is available at supergrubdisk.org. So for those of you who have ever had any trouble with grub, this is a great way to reinstall grub without having to wipe out your computer. Um, but if if you've got, uh, yeah, if you've got encryption on the drive, that might be a little bit different. That might not be a problem <coughs> like such as this. And I don't generally encrypt my drives because I don't have a use to. But, uh, but people in the chat room do mention that it, it can be really problematic to do mm-hmm. so. Uh, reinstalling Grub from Ubuntu disk using Terminal uh, is pretty easy, says Poet of Zwan. Absolutely. So, but uh, Super Grub disk makes it beyond easy. It's like, do you want to reinstall it? Yep. Uh, done. It's really, really straightforward, and it does some more advanced stuff as well. So, so I do recommend it because it, it can save a system for somebody who doesn't uh, who doesn't want to monkey with it. So, but unfortunately, if you've got encryption on there, I think the best thing for you to do uh, I would refer you to the uh, Ubuntu forums. Let's just see, uh, and you you might want to take that error message. You said it was an error twenty two.